about education briefly? I know that the federal government does not provide a huge amount of education in the local classroom, but what are your thoughts? What do we need to do with education? Well, what we need to do is to strengthen the student loan program. I think if you ask people, are you in favor of helping students get through college uh, by means of government loans, the overwhelming answer is yes. And we have an administration that has cut and cut and cut and cut every sort of educational support, not just for college loans, but also for grants to local communities. Uh, you, you know, uh, Rick Keller's talked a lot about his supposed help uh, for the Pell Grant program. Mm -hmm. He stopped talking about it lately. And the reason for that is that it's been cut to the bone. All the student loan programs have been cut to the bone. And why is that? Well, the simple answer is it's, it's because the government is running enormous deficits, mm -hmm. and it's doing that in order to pay for tax cuts for the rich. Mm. $70 billion recently passed. That's right, and uh, that's on top of all the earlier cuts that haven't been paid for. There's nothing wrong with cutting taxes. I think that ordinary people, people in the middle class, people in the working class, they're the ones who deserve a tax break. Mm. But what we've done is we've cut taxes on the millionaires, and we haven't found any way to pay for it. So we've gone from a situation six years ago when we were nine years away from eliminating the federal debt entirely mm. to a situation where we're borrowing $500 billion a year, which is, amounts to over $5,000 for every family of four in America. Okay. We're going to take a quick break, Alan. We'll be right back with uh, more of these important issues uh, here on the Lending Matters. Matter.